What's going on, guys? Hope you uh, started your Monday off, started your week off killing it. I know I sure did. But something, Jesus Christ, some things were a little more challenging today than usual, which is uh, what I'm on here to talk about. So, right, if you are, you know, running a business or maybe in college pursuing a degree or pursuing a career, or just trying to be a more productive human as a whole, you probably have like a, a list of things that you do every day, right? And I have a list of things I do every day. And I make sure those things get done every day because that is what gives me peace of mind. That's what allows me to sleep at night. And sometimes when we're practicing these skills and getting things done, Sometimes it just feels a little harder than other days. Obviously, that's life. That's This isn't really specifically what I'm trying to talk about. I'm not saying that, you know, some days you feel like it, some days you don't feel like it. Some days things are, like, just extra hard for no reason. Your productivity is slower and you're not as confident. And I don't know why. It's For some reason today, I had a lot of leads to call up. Like, today was a big list of follow-ups. And I just, like, something. Like I was getting butterflies before the calls. I wasn't... I didn't feel right about it. And I don't know why, um, you know, calling people on the phone and like selling through the phone is a skill set that's relatively new to me. So yeah. And it took me about like an, like more than an hour to follow up with all the leads. And like, it was a lot of leads. Like it was probably like 50 or maybe tw between 20 and 50. I know it's a pretty big range, whatever. But it took me a while to follow up with them because like, I was like, I was like pausing in between every call like and then I would call and then I wouldn't get an answer and then my confidence would go down even more and it was like a painful experience to get through the list today and I don't know why because I'm normally pretty you know easygoing pretty happy to call people because I know what I'm doing can help them out um I'm not gonna lie the leads have gotten mildly worse as, as I've scaled my ad spend they've gotten harder to get in touch with less qualified well not less qualified but just less interested as a whole it's making my job harder I'm learning along the way whatever point being right I still got through the list I'm done because I wasn't gonna end my day not getting done what I needed to get done I wasn't gonna use not feeling like it as a reason to not do it um, and it was hard. It was painful. It probably wasn't the best quality of work. And I only really got two calls, but I killed both of those calls. I'm very happy with the way I ask questions, the way I use my tone. And I don't know. There's some days where like, for some reason, just something in your brain is making something harder than it needs to be. Or I don't know. I've just been moving slow all day. It's been a slow day. I've been getting my stuff done. But it's been a slow day. This video kind of sucks. I'm not going to lie. Like, we're going to wrap this up here. But it's simple advice, but most of you still won't follow it. Most of you will have days where you don't feel like doing something. You're afraid to do something. Like, I was genuinely afraid to dial up the phone today, which is ridiculous. I don't know why. Like, first time since I, like, just started doing this that I felt that way. I probably got to, like, look internally a bit. But I still got it done. And, like, most of you guys won't do that. And when that adds up... Like, you know how many days I haven't felt like doing stuff throughout this whole entire year? Probably a lot. You know how many days I've worked this whole entire year? Every fucking day. Uh, so, you probably should... Like, sure, it's great. It's great to have feelings and to be emotionally in, intact and shit. But <laughs> but you, you can't let your feelings affect your actions. And that is a very challenging thing to do. Especially when that feeling is fear, like if you're afraid to do something. And a lot of people are afraid of a lot of things. Excuse me. A lot of people are afraid of a lot of things. And I can see how that can make it challenging to move the needle forward. But you, you're not going to move the needle forward unless you do the things you're afraid of. Because that next monster is always going to be something you're afraid of. So like, you just got this video is terrible i'm ending it here but i hope you got the point and if you don't feel like doing something today you better get that done like right now like why are you even watching this youtube video you probably have shit to do so go do it